Bonjour y'all. Welcome to Wellness for Everybody. I'm Amanda. Today I'm going to show you a couple of stretches slash exercises that are great for seniors. So as we get older, our body tends to lose muscle mass and in general we just, our body slows down. So the exercises I'm going to show you today are great for your core. And when you use these exercises to strengthen your core, it helps with a lot. It helps with uh, reduced back pain, um, everyday activities. So when we walk, climb stairs, bend down to tie your shoes, keep up with maybe your grandchildren, or if you're in any sports, if you go and play golf or anything like that, even so much as getting out of bed every morning. All of these help with helping that core strength. So we're going to do some seated ones and then we're going to do some on the mat on the floor as well. So the first one I'm going to show you, we're going to take our feet out straight. So our legs are straight, our feet are flexed, toes pointed up towards the ceiling, sitting up nice and tall. We're going to take our chin down to our chest and slowly keeping our back straight, reach down. Now you don't have to reach your toes, this is simply just a stretch. If you can, that's great. If not, that's fine too. And then we're going to roll up. Activating your core as you do this. Continuing to breathe. And so you would do a few of those every day. The next one we're going to do, we're keeping our knees at a 90 degree angle. We're going to take, let's do your right hand up to your head. Left hand, we're going to use our oblique muscles and just let it drop to your side. Nice stretch. Back up. And if this is easy for you, you could even use a light weight with it. Um, you know, a can of soup, a bottle of water whatever you have available to you to just cut that little extra weight and then you switch sides make sure you breathe we don't want any pain and this is working your obliques all right the next one we're going to do is leg lifts so keeping one leg bent we're going to stretch the other one out sitting up nice and tall we're just going to lift and lift. Switch sides. All of this is working your core. Anything that you do with this, make sure you're activating your core while you're doing them. So those are the three seated ones we're going to do. You've got the four roll. You've got the obliques, and you've got the leg lifts. All right, so we're going to be right back on the mat. All right, so we're on the floor, we've got our mat down. Um, the first one we're going to do is a plank, so that's going to work basically your entire body, but it's really good for your core. So. We're going to do elbow plank, so your elbows are directly under your shoulders. And we're in a straight line. You don't want to be too high or too low. It needs to be in a straight line. You should feel your core working. All right, if this is too much, you can drop down to your knees, but still keep that core activated. And make sure you breathe. All right, so while we're already here, we're going to lay flat on the floor and do supermans. So this is a really good back exercise. So a lot of people think core is just the abdomen. That is not true. Core is your entire trunk area, including your glutes. And we're going to work that in just a moment. So we're just going to lay flat on the floor. I'm going to take your arms out in front of you, feet and legs straight behind you. 
Gently rest your forehead on the mat. And you're gonna inhale, lifting your arms and your legs. So it's gonna look like this. And exhale back down. Inhale up. And exhale down. And you're using your back to pull your legs and your arms off the ground. All right, we'll be right back with the last one. All right, so for this one, we're gonna do glute bridges. So we're gonna sit on our butts. We're gonna keep our knees bent and we're just going to lay back on the floor. Now, the closer you can get your heels in, the better. And we're going to squeeze our glutes, lifting the hips. Hold it for a few seconds. Exhale, drop them back down. Inhale, squeeze and raise. Exhale, slowly control the descent. Inhale, squeeze, and gently release. And that's your glute bridges. All right, so I've given you a few exercises and stretches that are great for seniors. Anyone can do them, but again, as we get older, we're not really capable of doing some of the stuff that we may have done when we were younger. So these are great options to be able to keep you active and keep up with your grandchildren, playing any sports, and just doing everyday activities. So if you've liked it, you've learned anything, like the video, share the video, and subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you next time.